Hey there, folks. This is Colin Chisholm. Welcome back to Streaming Wars, your favorite streaming talking about stuff show. Uh, hopefully you have enjoyed your holiday break and are just ready for some new content to get you through the January blues here. Um, I'm going to start with a new show I recently watched that should actually help with just that. It's called The Big Brunch, and it's on Crave now via HBO, and it is amazing. And normally I don't say that about a cooking competition show, which is generally just something you have on in the background. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong, The Great Canadian and British Bake Off is, is, is great, and some other ones have been okay, but this, to me, is the kind of top of the pile. Uh, the Big Brunch is, like I said, a competition show where you have several contestants who are vying for this big prize. I believe it's $300,000 where they can use to like either jumpstart their business or develop some kind of food laboratory or who knows, whatever they want to do. Um, and, you know, they do every uh, episode is a new challenge. There's a new theme and it's all kind of based around the idea of brunch. You know, everyone's favorite meal that sits between breakfast and lunch, uh, often with some boozy drinks involved in, uh, as well. Um, and, but what makes the Big Brunch so good, I think, is the personalities and the people there. First of all, the judges. You have, uh, I mean, Dan Levy, who is just this hilarious, um, irreverent, dry, sarcastic person who is so endearing and so lovely. And he really is sort of the core of the show. But uh, also the, the other two judges are really good at sort of this back and forth banter and they're not afraid to drop some F-bombs when they need to. This is HBO after all. Um, but what's really lovely here, I think, is the contestants. They're all so sweet and so lovely with each other. There's a real sense of camaraderie that, that really comes through and they're helping each other, out, like even bringing each other's plates up uh, for, uh, for judging and that sort of thing. And it is honestly so heartwarming. Like it absolutely melted my cynical heart uh, watching this show. It was so, so lovely. So if you're looking for a show that is going to highlight some really cool, interesting, creative recipes and kind of the methodology that's behind it and the history and culture that's behind it, really fascinating stuff. Um, food is after all an art form. And you're seeing these people who are, you know, up and comers who are, you know, trying to break through into like, you know, uh, the food scene in a big way. It's just so neat to see them do their thing, but also, you know, working together and learning from each other, learning from their mistakes. And the judges aren't like little, um, you know, brats about it. They come back with like legitimate critiques and it's, it's just so good. It's, it's so well done. Um, normally these type of reality shows are very meh, but this one is lovely and I couldn't get enough of it and I, I hope we see more as well. Again, uh, it's called The Big Brunch. It is on Crave now uh, through HBO and highly recommend it. Anyway, you should check that out. Um, that's gonna do it for this episode of Streaming Wars, folks. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, we'll have more for you very soon. If you have any comments or thoughts, uh, send me an email, love to hear from you. You can also head over to our YouTube page where you should definitely subscribe and hit the bell and all that good stuff. And I mean, if you leave a comment, maybe I'll, maybe I'll reply. We'll see. Uh, you can also download the show on your favorite podcast player. And, you know, check out the other podcasts and videos and things that we have here at Saltwire. There's a ton of stuff, like a ton of it. And it's all really good. Like, go look at it. Anyway, that's it for today. Thanks so much for tuning in. Uh, we'll talk to you guys soon. So long.